So hello future developers, so welcome to the continuation of our previous lesson uh, which is the designing of the UI of um, Hajia's watch okay, um, e-commerce website. So uh, this is how far we've come and then in our previous lesson we we're able to do the blog and then the image and then just change um, the text, that's the icon color. So now what we would have to do now is to actually um, work with the icons, we would have to do some arrangement, alignment and the likes. So let's work with the icons and then we'll finally work on the um, actual alignment, okay? So now let's see what we have. We need this, okay? So all we have to do, since we already have... We already have this. Uh, all I have to do is to copy this, Control c Control v it, uh, drag it here. Okay, and then I can change the text to, let's see, I have get more. So double click and then I'm going to change it to get more, to so get more. Okay. And then we'll drag this here, then I'm going to stretch this. Okay. And then all I have to do is to go here and then pick the circle, circle to here. So the shape does the ellipse, okay, and then hold shift for a paper cycle. Then I'm going to draw here, and then um, first let's see the size of this shape. So our shape size, so it's 240 by 61, so 240 by 61. So let's click 240. by 61 okay so 240 by, by 61 um, I would actually want it to touch this okay so I can um, work on this now so, um, let's stretch this Then I'm going to have to bring this here. I can uh, enlarge it. Okay, so let's enlarge it a bit. So the size here is 48 by 48. Okay, so get more. Let's see. Get more. I'll leave the size as it is. And then um, this is going to be white. So I'm going to change its color. So the fill color is going to be white. Okay, okay it's already white. Okay, because of um, this, the column our grid is the one trying to. Uh, deceive us so now we'll would right click and then go to plugins and i'm going for iconify and then i'll just type arrow okay so arrow remember this requires internet connectivity so arrow and then let's select let's select this arrow icon Okay, better still, let's pick all our icons, okay, uh, since before, so that we don't go back. So we have the Chevron headphone, okay, so Chevron, let's pick Chevron. So Chevron, I'll pick Chevron. Okay, let me leave it here. Then I'm going to pick um, headphone. Then let's pick, let's say, Twitter. I'm choosing all the birds. Okay, this is too large. Okay, so let's, let's use, use 30 by 30 for it. What do you want to? I can't seem to find the bed. Okay, so we'll come back to Twitter. And then let's do that of LinkedIn. Uh, 
let's choose this one this is LinkedIn and then we want that of Facebook 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 uh, let's choose this okay so we can close our um, iconify let's mouse so this our bed I'm going to resize it okay by holding alt and shift or you can hold just um, shift okay to resize it perfectly then I can zoom in then let's um, see what we can do here Okay, so we have our icons now, and uh, all we have to do is to just um, let me just uh, control C, control V this. Okay, so I have my ellipse, you can see here. Then I'll change its color to green. To green. Or let's use black. Okay. And then I'm going to bring this icon to this place. Okay, let's check the size that we have here so 34 by 34 we can check to see if 24 by 24 let's see if that does the right size okay so we want this size okay now let's work on this okay so all i have to do is to change this to white that's our chevron to white okay so this chevron is actually going to act as a um, Okay, so it's going to act as a let's say a swipe okay so you click so that uh, the image changes okay so to make sure it's centered i can highlight them sorry so I'll highlight it to or you can multi select by holding the shift and then uh, let's center it okay and then center it okay Let's see if the size is good for us. So I think the size is good. So all I have to do now is just to group them since they're already highlighted. So now they become one object. So control G to group or you can highlight them in the right click and then look for group. Okay, since I've grouped them, I have one group. Okay. So this group. Now we can actually move this here because in our image here you can see the icons here are well aligned here. Okay. So let's uh, now move our icons okay. and then uh, in our next lesson okay we'll just work on the icons and then try positioning this wall and then do our final um, alignment okay and that should be it so thank you and then I'll see you guys in the next lesson thank you